Hello, my name is Jonathan Porterfield of Eco Cars, and another video clip of another great hybrid car. It's the Toyota Prius, registered the 5th of November 2008, so it is just over three years old, and it's uh, had its first MOT on the 14th of November 2008. So we've just picked this up from the leasing company. Um, so I'll talk you through some of the main features of the Prius and then uh, I'll be taking you for a short test drive as well. It looks very nice in this red and uh, as with all the Priuses we like to buy the T-Spirit which is the top of the range because it includes a reversing camera and some other options as well. On a 58 plate as you can see. Uh, there are three mats so the driver's mat is missing but there's nice good quality fabric mats for the front passenger and the two rear uh, footwells. Quite a spacious boot in the Prius. We also have a low cover and a 70-30 split to the rear seats. And underneath the boot floor, a very nice storage compartment. Uh, in here there's a basic first aid kit, a kit and a high visibility vest. And also some screen washes that came from the leasing company. And then under here we have the space saver spare wheel which has never been used. So uh, as with all the Prius that we've had, it runs very well indeed. High level brake light, rear wash wipe, small bee sting aerial. Being the T-Spirit, upgraded hi-fi, also get side impact airbags into the two front seats. It's very clean, uh, no rips or tears to any of the uh, fabric. A pair of cup holders in the back, mat pockets in the rear of the front seats and electric windows in the rear as well. We've got Isofix for the baby seat and three rear inertia seat belts along with a central armrest and also three rear adjustable headrests as well. With the back seats down, I'll just show you, it does turn into a rather, got the headrest down, rather carnivorous boot as you can see. So it's a very versatile family car, the Prius. And just looking in the front, height adjustable driver's seat. Again, no signs of any wear at all. They do wear very well, these Prius. And see, no rips or tears or any scrapes. The door cards are in very good order, no scratches. And the central armrest as well. And I'm showing the front driver's door card again, that's in very clean condition. Four electric windows with the driver's side being a one shot. To lock all the doors, isolate the windows, and electrically operated wind mirrors as well. So inside the Prius, I'll just run through uh, some of the basics. Uh, no doubt you've watched some previous videos for Prius, but uh, being the T-Spirit, I'll run through them now. We have cruise control, we have satellite navigation and information centre, Bluetooth, uh, phone connectivity, and also voice activation. Um, I can show you those now, actually. I'll just show you how we start Prius. Put the key in the slot, I put my foot on the brake and press power, that's it, the car is now running. Uh, I'll just show you before I forget, I guarantee the mileage there, 72,635 miles. This may be a little higher as we'll be using this car ourselves over the next few weeks until it's sold. So the sat-nav system, very clever, there we are in uh, in Bagworth Woods. And we also have an information centre which will give you a readout of whether the car's running on battery or petrol. And we'll explain all that to you when you come to look at the vehicle. All of these things can also be controlled from the centre of the uh, dashboard as well. Voice activation is excellent. Please say the command after B. Audio on. Turning audio system on. Which is really, really Indeed. useful. On a pair. Please say the command after B. Audio off. Turning audio system off. So that's very useful. You can also uh, make phone calls and also once you've plotted in your home address, press this in sat-nav mode and say home and it will automatically calculate your route home. So extremely useful. To answer calls and hang up on calls when you pair up your phone, um, to clear the front screen, heated rear screen, recirculate, uh, automatic climate control. So you press that and you can set the temperature 
again from the centre of the dashboard or from the steering wheel. Now I'm just knocking it down to 19 degrees. And you can also do that from the, the um, I'll show you. Please say the command after beep. 20 degrees. Setting temperature to 20 degrees. So that's very, very useful as well. So lots of options on the car. Control the sound system, the volume, skip modes, CD, radio or auxiliary input and skip tracks or radio stations. Variable intermittent wipe. We also have uh, the stalk here with all the lighting controls on front and rear fog lights. We also have park assist. So basically when the car is in reverse, we get the rear reversing camera and the car will actually park itself. Rather complicated and long-winded, very, very clever, where the steering wheel will actually turn of its own accord. So I can always demonstrate that to you when you come to pick up the vehicle. There's also an EV button here, which holds it in electric mode for longer. Six CD changer, and as well as controlling the music and the sound from the steering wheel, it can also be controlled from the centre here as well. We also have an auxiliary port where you can plug in your iPod, your MP3 down here. And there's also a 12 volt power socket. So Toyota really have thought of everything in this uh, in the top of the range Prius. It's very useful. Works very well. Lots of storage and cubby holes. Let's say it works very differently to uh, to other cars, but they work very well indeed. Uprated JBL speakers. Airbags in the A pillar, sides of the front seats, <clears throat> and also in the C pillar in the back as well. Some grab handles, roof linings in good order. Also a small storage compartment here for your glasses as well. So what a great car these are to own. So I'll just show you now some of the uh, history. So just looking at the uh, service history and the documents, we have the V5 here, um, leased by Tusker Direct Limited, so it was a lease vehicle, and there was no, show you the front, no previous, no previous keepers on the V5, so you'll be down as the second keeper. So class as an alternative fuel car, there's also the date of registration, and at 104 grams per kilometre CO2, it qualifies for £10 a year road tax. So I've just taxed it for, 10, for 12 months. So uh, £10 is neither here nor there, so it's got road tax on it. Also, it's uh, first MOT was carried out there on the 14th of November, so a little bit late, should have been the 5th, but it expires uh, 14th of November 2012, and it was done on the 15th of November 2011. There's the MOT test number, which you can check on Vosa's website, and there was no advisories, so it didn't just scrape through on anything. So good MOT, it's first MOT. Also the Toyota service book is here showing all the services being done at a main Toyota dealer, which I believe was Lister's. Yeah, there we go. So you can look up this uh, uh, Toyota group on the internet, Lister's Spittlegate level in Grantham. Service interval on the Prius is every 12 months or every 10,000 miles. So it was done at 10,700. 20,329, which was its 30,000 mile service, 42, 50, 60,000, and last, again at the same Toyota dealership, Listers of Grantham, at 70,398 miles, which was its 70,000 mile service, completed on the 3rd of October. 2011. So the next is due at 80,000 miles or the 3rd of October 2012. So great to see full Toyota service history and it always shows because they always drive absolutely fantastic. So uh, the rest of the folders, we're still waiting for the spare key and we're also still waiting for the rest of the book pack. So at the moment these are the only documents with the car but the locking wheel nut key is here present and correct. So I'll just show you under the monitor of the Prius, obviously there's the uh, hybrid Synergy Drive and also a small little 1.5 Yaris engine. So 
well proven system very very reliable as regards this car itself it's not showing any signs of any accident damage everything is original and aged as it should and of course it is HPI clear so uh, before I take you for a walk around the car I'll just take you now for a short test drive so welcome to the test drive so uh, we we'll put the key in the ignition press power that's it car started we have a, like a foot brake with underneath your um, left leg so engage drive with the foot on the brake uh, just wait for this cyclist to go before I run him over so it is very very quiet because we're not moving it makes so much sense so just pull away squeeze the throttle now because we're going down a hill I'm going to ease off the throttle now, I've reached 30 miles an hour and uh, you can't perhaps see in the screen but we're now regenerating power into the battery, we're not using any petrol at all and I'm doing 38 miles an hour. It drives very well, turns into the corners fine like all your Prius, they really are a very well made car. Um, still not used any petrol yet just squeeze the throttle and we're just drawing current from the battery to maintain our speed and now come off the throttle for this bend I'm doing 43 miles an hour again I'm not using any fuel and now regenerating power back into the battery so these really do favor a gentle driving style to get the best economy of 55 to 60 miles per hour now if I want to accelerate Perhaps here the petrol engine has started up, we're now being pulled along by the engine as well as the battery and the electric motor. Makes so much sense, if you don't need the engine, why have the engine running? It's very comfortable, very quiet. We find it very relaxing to drive a Prius. And uh, I say, it drives straight as pull to the left or the right. I'll just pull over now and just to show we're going to come to a stop and what can we hear absolutely nothing apart from the indicator the engine's off we're still ready to go but if you don't need the engine why have it on so I'll just take you now for a final walk around the car so welcome back from the test drive so I'll just point out all the uh, imperfections I can find uh, just show you I've just taxed it today dizzy heights of just 10 pounds to the end of February 2013. The windscreen is chip free, no marks in the windscreen. As with all uh, these Prius, they all tend to pick up a few stone chips. Now I will touch these in with a Toyota touching pen. There's a few stone chips to the uh, to the bonnet. These are aluminium bonnets to save weight so it'll never rust. And the front corner's fine. And that front corner is showing just a little graze just there but nothing to be overly concerned about the discs are fine they have been replaced because these need replacing is about 60,000 miles so the discs have been done and just go around the tires that is a practically brand new Bridgestone tire on the front wing mirrors are fine often these get scuffed looking down the side it's a small mark there which will polish out so we've not yet prepared this We've just picked it straight up from uh, the lease company. Wheel trim wise, this wheel trim is showing a tiny amount of scuffing. These are about £30 to replace, but uh, they often get curbed. Uh, this wheel trim is showing a little bit more scuffing. Again, this can easily be replaced for about £30 from Toyota. So, looking around the rear corners, now the back bumper's got some scrapes and marks, which again I will touch in with the touching pen. There's also a scrape there. These are plastic bumpers, of course. And a small scrape there, which will touch in and will virtually be invisible when I get the uh, touching pen next week. This wheel trim is nearly perfect. A few marks on it, in very clean condition. The rear discs are fine as well. And the front near side often gets curbed, showing a little bit of catch into the plastic wheel trim. Tyres again. Another Bridgestone on the front, very, very recent indeed. 
rear tyres, lots of tread, I'd say three, four millimetres on that tyre. And this tyre again, about five millimetres. So good tyres all round. The roof's fine, there's no dinks or dents on the car. There's a scratch here, which again we're going to touch in and get our paint man to polish out. So just to be aware of that scratch. Other than that, really is a very nice top of the range Prius. £10 a year to tax. I think they're Group 7 insurance. And will return between 55 and 60 miles to the gallon. And very easy to drive and very nice to live with as a hybrid car. So thank you for watching. If you have any more questions about this or any of our eco-friendly vehicles, then feel free to give me Jonathan a call anytime. Thank you.